Welcome back. You're watching BioCell. Uh, we have take a detour. Let's talk about Birla Med Spa, uh, the stock which recently entered the market, recently got listed. The, today the stock's doing pretty well. Let's pull up the stock and see where the stock is right now. And then we'll of course uh, tell you what's the story behind the stock doing well. Birla Pacific Med Spa is the stock that we're talking about. The stock's doing pretty good as far as trade is concerned. Apparently there's a big investor who has come into the company. The stock's up 3%. I think this is the biggest gain for the stock ever since it got listed. Apparently, reports suggest that Amitabh Bachchan has bought about uh, 1 million shares as far as this company at 18.50. Let's uh, go to the management. Uh, PVR Murthy joins us, Group Finance Director at the Yash Pirla Group, joining us. So, thanks for joining us. Uh, thanks for taking out the time. You know, uh, marquee investors uh, uh, coming into the company, what does that suggest? Uh, are they reading into growth prospects which you're line, lining up ahead? Uh, in the last interaction that we had with you on the IPO, you flagged off what are your growth plans. Can you elaborate a little bit more? Uh, for FI12, for FI13, what's the kind of ramp up that you're looking at? Yeah, uh, we at Ashbella Group, we always believed healthcare sector is uh, one of the emerging sectors in the next decade. And that's how we entered into the healthcare sector. And we came out with the IPO recently. And uh, what we looked at, Mr. Bachan also must have looked at the growth in the healthcare sector. That's how you must have invested in this uh, share that is at this price. And in any case, the price is uh, quite good when we offered it at 10 rupees. Uh, uh, the growth prospect has to be good in the healthcare sector in future. And we have also reasonably good plans, which were already listed in the uh, offer document, which includes uh, opening of 55 retail centers. Uh, ours is a different uh, concept altogether. It is a basically med spa, not a spa which general uh, people talk, talk about it. And then here we have cosmetic surgery, cosmetic dentistry, and then we have all makeover, total makeover solutions which include hyposection, weight reduction, all that. Mm -hmm. This uh, industry as such is growing in a rapid uh, pace. And uh, we have good growth plans. I will not be able to spell out what could be the... Uh, turnover for this uh, year or the next year. But mm -hmm. what could I say is it will go quite uh, substantially higher than what it was before. Right. You know, uh, Mr. Muthi, if you uh, uh, if you recall in the market, uh, there have been a couple of uh, such companies which have come up in the past as well. I was uh, just reading through that. Uh, Kaya, a brand which was actually launched by Marico, a concept uh, yeah, which yeah. they had actually launched, didn't do pretty well. But again, yours is a completely different scope of operation that you're looking at. Can you talk about the demand environment, particularly for the concept that you're operating in right now? I know consumption side still doing very well as far as the Indian economy is concerned. But uh, uh, what kind of growth figures are you looking at when it comes to your business? You see, the growth, uh, the, the, see, once we complete all our uh, centers, 55 centers, the growth could uh, jump into almost 50 percent. The uh, compounded growth uh, each year could be around 20, 25 percent. In the next two years, it could be 50 percent growth with a reasonably good bottom line. The major expense in these things is only brand building, which we have already done in the last uh, one and a half, two years. That's why there will not be much brand building expenses in the next two years, which will add to the bottom line. You mentioned about brand building. Would you look at some kind of a strategic tie-up to augment your presence, not only in the Indian market, but perhaps looking at some other developing markets? I'm just Yeah, we, we are looking at uh, uh, some acquisitions also. Um, but it all depends uh, what kind of acquisition we will get. We are already in talks with uh, to many people abroad. But nothing has been finalized. That's why I'll not be able to spell out anything. All right, Mr. Murthy. We'll leave it at that. Good luck with all your growth plans. Well, the Big B's entry definitely has done uh, something good for the company. The stock's up 3%. Uh, looking good. 1880 is where the stock is. 1850 is what the price at which uh, Mr. Bachchan bought the stock. Uh, we'll take a break right now. But This is NDTV. And you're watching NDTV Profit.